Hello everyone. Lisa, a member of the popular girl group Blackpink, is set to captivate the world again with her performance at the 2024 Victoria's Secret Fashion Show. Her presence at this iconic event has become one of the most anticipated moments, considering Lisa's global popularity as a fashion and music icon. Fans can watch her live performance through the official Instagram and TikTok accounts of Victoria's Secret, at Where Aloud, on October 15, 2024, at 6.50 p.m. Eastern Time. Lisa is known not only for her skills in dancing and rapping but also for her bold and innovative style in the fashion world. She has become the face of several renowned brands such as Celine, MAC Cosmetics, and Bulgari, and frequently graces the pages of major fashion magazines. Her appearance at the 2024 Victoria's Secret Fashion Show reinforces her position as one of the most influential figures in fashion and entertainment. Victoria's Secret Fashion Show 2024 returns with a new concept. After a hiatus of several years, the Victoria's Secret Fashion Show is back with a fresher and more global concept. This year, they are showcasing more than just a fashion parade, the event serves as a platform to celebrate creativity and cultural diversity. Lisa, as one of the most influential Asian celebrities, is considered the perfect choice to represent this new spirit. Fans worldwide are eagerly anticipating her performance, especially given Lisa's reputation for always delivering stunning performances on various international stages. Her collaboration with Victoria's Secret is seen as a meeting of two icons that define modern trends and exert a strong influence in their respective industries. To engage a global audience and provide a more inclusive experience, the Victoria's Secret Fashion Show 2024 will be broadcast live on social media platforms. Fans can follow the official account at Wear Aloud on Instagram and TikTok to catch exciting moments, including Lisa's special performance. The event is scheduled to start at 6.50 p.m. Eastern Time on October 15, 2024, and is expected to be a highlight in this year's fashion calendar. Lisa's performance at this event is expected to showcase a blend of music, dance, and fashion, something that has become her trademark. Fans can anticipate seeing Lisa wearing iconic outfits from Victoria's Secret with a personal touch that reflects her unique style. Additionally, the event is likely to feature creative collaborations from other renowned musicians and models, creating an unforgettable visual experience. Lisa has repeatedly proven that she always gives her best in every opportunity, and the 2024 Victoria's Secret Fashion Show is believed to be one of her standout performances. Through a combination of art, music, and fashion, Lisa will provide an unforgettable experience for viewers worldwide. With excitement already peaking, Lisa's involvement in the 2024 Victoria's Secret Fashion Show is not just a performance but a symbol of the growing influence of Korean and Asian pop culture on the international stage. This collaboration emphasizes that fashion and music are increasingly interconnected, creating captivating cross-industry experiences. Many fans predict that Lisa will bring surprises to her performance, whether through stunning choreography or outfits that reflect her essence. Given her reputation for always going all out on stage, audiences can expect more than just an ordinary fashion show. This event also represents an important moment for Victoria's Secret, which is working to refresh its image by showcasing more diverse and relevant faces. Lisa's unique charm and charisma are expected to reinforce the message of inclusivity and innovation in the fashion world. For those who don't want to miss out, 
Make sure your internet connection is stable and follow the official account at Wear Aloud on Instagram or TikTok. Get ready to witness a blend of fashion, art, and music in an iconic show that will be remembered for a long time. Additionally, Jenny from Blackpink also talks about her solo comeback and life in New Zealand. On October 15, KST, Wired released an exclusive interview with Jenny, one of the Blackpink members, on their YouTube channel. The interview uses a Q&A format, where Jenny responds to a number of popular questions about her on Google. In the interview, Jenny discusses not only her career with Blackpink but also shares personal stories, including her life in New Zealand and her experiences as a solo artist. When asked when she joined Blackpink, Jenny enthusiastically replied, I have always been a member of Blackpink. We released our debut single in August 2016. This statement confirms her journey as part of the group from the very beginning. Jenny also opened up about her childhood in New Zealand. I moved to New Zealand when I was 9 years old and lived there until I was 14, she said. She added that during her time there, she had a strong English accent. I used to have a strong accent, but now it's completely gone. It makes me sad because people don't know I lived in New Zealand, Jenny said nostalgically. She also shared her fondness for some local foods from that country. I love Marmite, she revealed. Jenny reminisced about moments when she and Rose, her group mate who also spent time in New Zealand, were very happy when they received gifts of Vegemite or Marmite. Jenny talked about her iconic solo debut song, Solo, and how much time has passed since its release. It's been about five to six years, but let's just say five. It feels like a long time ago, she recalled while reminiscing about the preparation for the song. She mentioned that while preparing for her comeback with her new song, Mantra, she looked back at videos and photos from when she was working on, Solo. I looked so young and cute back then, Jenny said with a smile. Jenny also shared her views on the differences between working as a group member and as a solo artist. Working as a solo artist is very different. You're alone in the studio, she explained. When she is in a group, she and the other Blackpink members always discuss every decision together. We would move forward if everyone agreed. But now, I have to make all the decisions myself, and that's the biggest difference. Besides her career, Jenny also talked about her true personality, which may not be well known to her fans. I'm actually very shy, Jenny revealed. She added that among her friends, she tends to be the quietest. However, the person you see on stage is very different from that, she said. Jenny hopes that with her openness, she can get closer to her fans. I hope we can get to know each other better, she concluded with that hope. This interview provides an in-depth look at Jenny, both as a public figure and as a person. With all her achievements and reflections, Jenny showcases her authentic side and maturity, both as a part of Blackpink and in her solo career. The interview not only highlights Jenny's career journey but also depicts her rarely seen personal side. Jenny's openness about her past in New Zealand, where she formed many memories and experiences, offers new insights for her fans. Her relationship with Rose also shows how close their friendship is, even before they joined Blackpink. Additionally, Jenny's reflections on the differences between working solo and in a group highlight the challenges she faces. The creative process as a solo artist forces Jenny to make decisions independently, in contrast to the more collaborative dynamics of a group. 
However, this also gives her the space to grow and express herself more freely. Her shy personality behind the scenes contrasts interestingly with the strong and charismatic persona she presents on stage. Jenny wants her fans to know that there is another side of her that is simpler and more vulnerable, hoping to build a closer and more genuine relationship with them.